Hey, what's going on guys? Fred Tech Up here. So, in today's video, I will be comparing the Infinix Note 6 with the Redmi Note 7. This has been one of the most requested videos on this channel and I'm giving it to you guys today. And I will also be giving away the Infinix Note 6 to one lucky subscriber. So you make sure you watch this video to the end to know more about the giveaway. So without wasting much of your time, let's get to the video. The Infinix Note 6 is a new kid in the block and right now it has generated so much hype for itself. So with all this hype, does it have what it takes to fight the Redmi Note 7? As usual, let's start with the design and build quality. These two takes different approach when it comes to design. The Note 6 is made entirely from metal and it is the one with the most conservative design here. It has a huge bezel on top and bottom of the display which might be a deal breaker for some people and that's by no means a 2019 standard. And right next to the Redmi Note 7 it looks a little bit old but the metal build takes the quality a step higher. While the Redmi Note 7 on the other hand embraces the industry leading and trendy design which I love very much, it is made from glass and the whole design aesthetics feels modern and well made. The water drop notch and a near zero bezel makes it look beautiful and attractive. So when it comes to design, the Redmi Note 7 takes the lead here, while both stays equal when it comes to build quality. Okay, moving on is the display and this is where the Note 6 shines with its beautiful AMOLED display. It is rich and vibrant, super sharp, more saturated with accurate colors and very vivid. The display has a 1080p resolution on a 6.01 inch display. Then on the flip side, the Redmi Note 7 also has a 1080p resolution on a 6.3 inch display with up to 506 nits of peak brightness. It is very sharp and bright outdoors with good viewing angles too. But the AMOLED display on the Note 6 is much better, especially if you keep the two side by side. And that's where you will appreciate the Infinix Note 6 more. In addition to this, the Redmi Note 7 has a Gorilla Glass 5 protection while the Infinix Note 6 has a Gorilla Glass 3 protection. So on the spec sheets, both phones pack impressive specification for the price. The Note 6 comes with the MediaTek Helio P35 Octa-Core CPU paired with the 4GB of RAM, while the Redmi Note 7 has the Snapdragon 660 Octa-Core CPU paired with the 4GB of RAM. Both phones run on the latest Android 9 Pi on top of their respective custom software, which is XOS 5.0 Cheetah on the Infinix Note 6 and MIUI 10 on the Redmi Note 7. These two perform very well and they handle basic tasks effectively. Switching between apps and general multitasking is trouble free on both phones. However, the MIUI has come a long way and it has improved a lot. It is not as cluttered as the XOS on the Infinix Note 6. There's less Bluetooth and it further makes the user interface a lot cleaner with less slack. While the reverse is a case with the Infinix Note 6. Occasional lack is present on both phones but it is far from something that can affect your daily usage. Performance is close to each other though the Redmi Note 7 pushes ahead in benchmark results and slightly noticeable performance peak in real world use. So being a Note device, you will expect the Redmi Note 7 to come with the Note taking and drawing capabilities, right? Nah, that's not the case here. It's a basic smartphone without all of that. So the Infinix Note 6 pushes ahead here with its awesome Note taking and drawing capabilities. Both devices come with the fingerprint unlocking solution and first unlock and I would say they work effectively. Okay, about the camera, the Infinix Note 6 packs a 3 sensor behind which is a 16 megapixels main sensor, an 8 megapixels ultra wide lens and a 2 megapixels depth sensor. While the Redmi Note 7 comes with just 2 camera behind. It is a huge and impressive 48 megapixels camera and a 5 megapixels depth sensor. And I would say I'm really impressed with the Infinix Note 6 here. The 16 megapixels perform very well and in some cases the image appears neck to neck with 
the Redmi Note 6. Though high dynamic range appears weaker on the Note 6 but overall image quality is good. The 48 megapixels camera on the Redmi Note 7 takes sharp and detailed images. High dynamic range on the Redmi Note 7 is good and is also better than the Note 6. Both phone has better edge detection on its portrait shots, but Redmi Note 7 slightly performs better due to its slightly bigger 5 megapixels depth sensor. The Redmi Note 7 lacks ultra wide camera so this becomes a plus for the Infinix Note 6. On the selfie side, both phones perform very well. However, the Redmi Note 7 returns more details to its selfie images than the Infinix Note 6 and color reproduction appears better on the Redmi Note 7, but the Note 6 isn't too far off. Both phones record video in 1080p resolution and I must say the Redmi Note 7 is much better here. Not only did it handle stability better, it also outperformed the Infinix Note 6 in sharpness and overall video quality. So these two devices come with the 4000 mAh battery and they both perform excellent in this regard. These two can basically last for a day and have on a moderate use. The Infinix Note 6 supports X charge which means it will slightly charge faster while the Redmi Note 7 supports Qualcomm Quick Charge 4.0 and it's included 18 watt fast charger. Another plus for the Redmi Note 7 is a Type-C charging port instead of a micro USB charging port found on the Infinix Note 6. So, to sum things up, both phones are impressive in their respective areas. The Note 6 stands out with its impressive X-Pen for note-taking and drawing capabilities, while the Redmi Note 7 shines away with its impressive design, excellent camera, a faster processor, and a clean user interface. Nearly zero bezel and the water drop notch making it look very attractive. They both cost about the same. The Infinix Note 6 actual cost is 65,000 Naira while the Redmi Note 7 is 68,000 Naira, both available on Jumia Nigeria. So as much as I love the Redmi Note 7 design and how appealing it looks, I still think the Note 6 deserves a better stand right next to the Redmi Note 7 because of its impressive AMOLED display and note taking capabilities. But the Redmi Note 7 is overall much better device here. So guys, back to the giveaway. I will be teaming up with my friends at Valor Reviews to give away the Infinix Note 6. Yes. So all you need to do is subscribe to my channel, subscribe to Valor Reviews channel, which is very important. Make sure you follow us on Instagram and Twitter. You can tag along some of your friends to stand a better chance of winning. And that's pretty much it. Then in two weeks time, I'm going to announce the winner. And that's basically it. So that is it guys. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know what you think about these two devices in the comment section below. If you're given the opportunity to choose one, which would you choose and why? Let me know in the comment section below. Thank you so much for your time and I'll talk to you in my next video. Bye-bye.